Globally, at least 4.3 million girls are at risk of female genital mutilation, according to a recent United Nations Population Fund report. In Kenya, the prevalence has reduced from 21% in 2014 to 15% in 2022. Despite Kenya having a robust anti-FGM legal framework, civil society organizations such as Each Rights are raising awareness on the issue. There is increasing global opposition to FGM and a willingness to prosecute those participating in the practice, but... Adhimal said that 45 was once a female cutter of young girls and only got to a turning point after the frequent outreach talks organized by the Marsabit Women Advocacy and Development Organization Group Mwado. Village elders have also not been left behind. The Marsabit government, in partnership with different organizations, are working to implement the gender policy. We began our programming around FGM in 2016 in Masabit uh, together with two other counties that is uh, Garissa and uh, Kajiado. Uh, so since then we've uh, made some strides. Um, first of all I think for, for us our biggest achievement is the ongoing formulation of the Masabit County Integrated Child Protection Policy uh, which of course uh, <clears throat> talks in detail uh, about some of the interventions that are required uh, to address uh, FGM or female genital mutilation uh, in the county.